Well, I've checked it. I've made it all the way into New York. Yay! I've, even though I was horrified on the puddle jumper because it kept shaking and had a lot of turbulence, I'm in my hostel that I'm staying at, which is the International, it's the, is it the International Youth Hostel? Or Hostling International New York. Uh, can't see, see the logo, probably. But, um, aka Hi New York. You can't find it on hostels.com or I think even Hostel World, maybe you can. You have to reserve it specifically through like Hi, like look up Hostling International New York on Google or whatever search engine and you'll find it and you can book you book specifically like through their website because I know I've been on hostels.com a bunch of time and I hadn't seen this um, it seems pretty nice like the two pieces of paper I was holding is you get uh, your breakfast vouchers where you should get continental breakfast which you either get coffee tea or hot chocolate a bagel with butter or cream cheese or cereal and a piece of fruit so that's nice um, I'm actually surprised with the fact that, not the fact that I get bedding, but the fact that I get a towel, because I wasn't expecting to be able to have a towel, so I brought a towel, and that could have been one thing less to pack. <sighs> you gotta love when those things happen, you're just like, oh, I have a towel to use, yay. Um, yeah, it seems really pretty clean in here. And there's lots of people. Well, not in my room right now, but I'm in a six bedroom, a six mixed bedroom. Who knows who I might be um, bunking with? Because they, I was reading this information at the front said like they don't discriminate age, sex, race, religion, sexual orientation, yada yada yada. Yeah, basically it's like we're all inclusive. Um, so that's cool. Where am I? I'm on the. I'm on the upper west side of Central Park on 103rd Street in Amsterdam. There's a the little sign out the window. So, you know, like, about exactly where I am. It'd be really weird if, like, somebody who's watching this is here, but it looks really nice. I'm just really tired, and I might have to start working in about, uh about an hour or two so I don't want to like maybe in like about an hour so I don't want to run too far from the hostel I need to take my meds as well it's been a slow day to start off with but today I'm visiting seeing my seeing this beautiful person in front of me I don't know if she wants to be videotaped she doesn't want to but yes at Cafe Shane over by the Brooklyn Botanical Gardens I'm gonna have me some Chicken and waffles. <laughs> uh, but I'm gonna enjoy them too because they look delicious. Waffles are really good. Haven't gotten the chicken yet, but ooh, I'm so excited. About to wander into the Brooklyn Botanical Garden, as you can see the sign over there. <laughs> Ta -da! And. One of the great fun things we found out because I, I was just like, for some reason I remember something being free. And ta-da, Tuesdays. Free. free. <laughs> oh, that's what she was trying to figure out too. <laughs> Saturdays, 10 to noon, free. Seniors admitted free every Friday and except on Saturdays with festivals, which is, they have an Asian festival here. It's free. So, again, free. <laughs> And if you're a student, it's four dollars. I guess any other day. And senior sixty-five and over, it's four dollars. And adults are eight dollars. But there's also membership. And you know, membership's always good for discounts. But of course, I like free. <laughs> so luckily, I'm here on a Tuesday, and it's free. That works out. <laughs> Chris, 